Hey guys, this is Andres Smirnov reporting for the Fast Lane Car from the 2016 New York International Auto Show. And behind me is the Honda Civic hatchback concept. But what you see here, their overall shape and proportions is basically what the next hatchback is gonna look like. And I learned a little tidbit of information about the exhaust system that you may not know. And everything you wanted to know segment is coming up right now. Honda Pro Jason. What's happening, Andre? How are you? Good to see you here. Good to see you, my friend. What do you think about the new uh, hatchback concept I, here? You know what? I like the hatchback concept when I first saw pictures of it in Geneva. Yeah. But to actually see it here in U.S. soil, it looks spectacular. Right. And learning more about it, learning that there's going to be a six-speed available, which is awesome. All turbo engines, yeah. which is going to be amazing. It's just, it's awesome. The styling, I like the styling. It takes the sedan and extends it slightly and gives it that real hatchback look. We've got the, the latest addition to the Civic lineup with the uh, hatchback prototype concept that we're showing. It originally debuted in uh, Geneva. Now we have it here for the first time in North America. First of all, this is a new variant of the Civic yes. coming to the showrooms. What is the car at the high level? Well, big thing is uh, we think this car will capture a whole different unique buyer. Um, Civic's been a long time outstanding vehicle in the U.S. This gives us an opportunity as the first time to launch a five-door variation into the lineup, uh, capturing more of the progressive utility buyer, someone with more active lifestyle, um, wants the utility but still wants the outstanding driving performance that the Civic offers. So this is a concept, correct? This is a concept. But this is going to be a production version, and when is it coming? It's coming uh, fall of this year, okay. uh, and this is a very close representation of the production model. Is pricing available yet? It's not yet available. Okay. We'll, we'll give you more information. So can you, you go over the big news, you know, the engine, the powertrain, and you know, what's, what's the story there? So all of the five doors will come with a base 1.5 liter turbo, uh, 174 horsepower similar to the sedan. Um, it, it's, it's a great performing European inspired uh, drive tuning. Um, as you can see, I don't know if the camera can see, but the, the sportier exhaust system and and the overall styling of the vehicle, much more of a driving vehicle. So is the center exhaust gonna come to production as well? It will be available on certain trims. Okay, and what about transmissions? Transmissions. Yes. So we're proud to announce that we're gonna have manual transmissions available on all the turbo motors from the base. Um, we also have a CVT with the uh, torque converter. So this joining the sedan and the coupe, correct? Yes. So we really believe that the five-door buyer, that someone that's going to gravitate towards this, expects high premium feature content as well as technology and connectivity. We also announced that the Type R is coming. Um, the Civic Si will also be coming um, and soon. And when approximately are those? What's the cadence for those models? It'll come. Well, we'll launch this in the fall, and soon after, going into the 17 calendar year, we'll see the the sportier variants. It'll capture a very unique. Uh, customer, someone that really likes that European-inspired uh, driving experience. So Honda Sensing also will be available um, on, the trim, on all the trims, standard on the, the top level trim, uh, which will have all of the same features that with the autonomous braking and other uh, semi-autonomous or what we refer to as semi-autonomous safety equipment. Yeah, can you go over just what's included in that package? So low speed follow, lane keep assist, the autonomous uh, braking. Those are the features usually available on higher end, more premium yes. cars, but it's here in the Civic as well, right? Well, as, as you know, the company is very uh, concerned about the safety of customers, and we believe that really the, the buyers are expecting that type of technology in their cars. The turbocharged engine in the Civic hatchback will make at least 174 horsepower. It will be mated to a six-speed manual transmission or a CVT, of course, it has a lot more utility, and the center exhaust outlets might make it to a production version in some form or another. Go back to tflcar.com for more news views and real-world reviews, and full coverage from the 2016 New York International Auto Show.
So here we are uh, with the 2017 MDX. Uh, basically a mid-cycle model change for us, but an incredibly extensive one. The most noticeable thing is new grille um, that we introduced in Detroit on our Precision Concept. But on top of that, under the hood of this, of this vehicle here, this is a new hybrid model for the MDX, so it's very exciting. 